guys I just wanted to do a quick video um, showing you guys something I got for Christmas for the camper um, my wife was awesome enough to get me this new temperature gauge it has four different locations on it um, number one is the front of our camper that's in our living room uh, number two is the back of our camper that is in our bedroom number three that is our undercarriage um, that's where we keep all of our uh, water equipment and all that stuff so it's good to have a temperature gauge down there so that you know things aren't freezing. Uh, number three, or the last one there, is obviously the indoor and then there is a number four which is outside um, but I have it inside right now because I'd, we had it stuck to the side of the camper and it wasn't reading correctly. So um, I just wanted to show you guys this. This can be a great tool to help you uh, make sure your pipes aren't freezing, um, make sure that you're not getting too much moisture in the camper. It, as you can tell, all of these have moisture sensors on the right hand side here. Uh, this is pretty good that we have a dry area in the underneath compartment. Uh, keeps everything from you know, getting moist down there. There's a lot of electrical connect, uh, connectors down there and all that stuff, so it's nice to keep this area really dry. Um, so I just wanted to let you guys know about that. This is a great resource. This is a great thing to have. And it wasn't really that expensive. Uh, I will show you guys the box so that you can see what the brand is and all that stuff. This is what each one of the sensors look like. Uh, they have the temperature reading right on them, right there on the top. And then on the bottom is the uh, humidity reading. And so you can see those right on each one of the sensors, which is great too. But then it also reads on the main sensor uh, that I showed in the beginning of the video. Here's the one in the living room. We have it uh, as the, far, the furthest point forward we can find in the camper, uh, just so that we could get an accurate reading of the nose of the camper's temperature and the humidity up here. This is the box for the device I've been talking about. If you want, you can pause it on any of these. So just get a better look. Please consider liking, sharing, and subscribing. That way you can help us get the word out about any uh, tiny home tips and tricks and just what it's like to live the nomad life.